Welcome back folks, back out. So as you can tell, turned up when it's dark. We night hike, can't beat it. Yep, winter's coming. So it's definitely, temperature's dropped. I think uh, this morning when I got up, first morning, frost in the car. So it's definitely, that's it. The winter weather's starting to, starting to definitely creep in. Uh, got here pretty late again tonight. I don't know, it's about half nine at night. So I'm going to be setting up in the dark. So before I do anything, I'm going to get my tent up, get my sleeping arrangements set up. Whether I have some tea tonight, I don't know. Uh, wait and see. Well, you know me. I'll probably will have some tea. In fact, you know I'll have some tea. But I'm going to get the tent set up. Uh, I've got the Old Pro Voyager with me tonight. No, sorry, the Old Pro Ranger with me tonight. So I'm going to get that set up. And then I'll bring you back. So, don't go away. Um, right, tent set up. I was just kind of flung up, to be honest. Uh, sleeping arrangements tonight. I can focus here. I've just got the foil. It's basically that. It's a butter foil, whatever it's called. I think it's an Eddie Hoy 21 pound inflatable mat. X Army sleeping bag. All Pro Ranger. It's a lot of sack of tatties. But we're out. It's definitely. It's quite as cold all the night. Before I do anything, you know what time it is. It's time for a brew. Before I do, before I do anything else, I'm gonna have a wee brew. Boom shack up. So, tonight lies in the Galloway Forest. Let's say, got here really late. Tonight, because I got here so late and it's a solo, I'm actually, I probably won't do too much filming tonight. But I will, be, I will do some. I'm also going to see if I can get some good night shots tonight. That's one of the good thing about winter camping, usually kind of reasonably clear nights. It's just, it was a lovely day today. But things on, things things to do, as I normally do on a Friday. I've been off my work all week, so it's been great. Absolutely fantastic. So I've been out a, a few times, I've got a few videos done this week. Whereas uh, tonight, tonight can hear something just in the background there, it must be geese or something. I actually thought that was some, I actually thought that was somebody there. <laughs> I'm going to try and get some, some decent shots with the camera tonight. See if I can get some shots with the, the tent kind of lit up. Uh, maybe get some stars, I don't know, I don't know if there's that many stars, it seems a wee bit cloudy but I did see the, the moon's looking quite good. Tonight up behind the clouds, so we'll see if I can get a couple of good photos. But I don't know, it must be. What time is it? 20 to 10. Night shit, young. I'm going to have a brew. I've got, I've got a few ciders with me. This is actually, I'm actually looking for a two nighter. Tonight I'm doing so. Tomorrow night I'm going to meet up with, uh, right, who's all coming? Scottish Wanderer, Bugsy, Marco, and I think Johnny might make it as well. Oh, and Marco's uh, girl Lee as well. So it's going to be four or five, yes, I think. That's tomorrow night, but tonight, all my lonesome. All alone, out in the middle of nowhere, the freezing cold. Well, we can't actually make it out that well, but you can actually see the. What would you call it? It's not steam. What would you call it? 
must rubber. You know, as you can see, I'm bereft basically. Uh, I did actually see a couple of other folk at camp tonight, but I've seen a, a couple of tents on the way in. Uh, kind of fires in the distance, so there's definitely a few other folk out. Nice one. So I like to see. That's a bit of hype, isn't it? Uh, I've never been here before. I just like coming out sometimes and there's something about getting out and exploring. You get a lot of folk asking you, where's that, where's this? I've heard me say a phone, I just don't, I don't like to tell folk anymore where I camp. It's just too many places, places get trashed. So what I say to folk is, look, go on Google Maps, go and explore, just get out there and, and go and find your own spot. I always think that's part of the adventure. I don't know about anybody else. Right, brew done. Well, first brew done. I'll probably get something I've got the Tranja last me the night, so I'll probably cook I'm saying cook something like that, I don't know whether I will. I've got a couple of ration packs, I've even got a pot of noodles. <laughs> Pure laziness. Whereas tomorrow or oh, tomorrow or oh, it's out with the Dutch oven again. And I've got some oh this'll be good tomorrow. Especially on a cold night. So I love about the Dutch oven. But I'll say no more. Help me in the next video uh, when I'm out with the, the rest of them. I'm going to cook something in the Dutch oven. I've cooked this before and it's, it's lovely. Absolutely lovely. Uh, right, anyway, I'm babbling on. I'm going to gonna say get sorted out, but I'm kind of more or less sorted out. What I might do, I might actually go out and see if I can get a couple of photos. Uh, whether it's going to rain the night or not. But I want to try and get a couple of photos while it's dry. So, don't go away. I'll bring you back. Yeah, we've actually got a couple of no bad photos there. But, right now, if in doubt, get the tranja out. I'm going to get the tranja on, boil up some water. I can't be bothered cooking in fancy the night. So it's time for a pot in the dough. Pot curry, pot rice. Remember that advert? Don't know about anybody else, but my favourite pot in the dough is original curry. Comment below. What was your what was your what's your favourite pot in the dough? Would you like a pot in the dough? I don't normally actually cook well, I used to eat a lot of pot in the doughs, but obviously I do like doing proper cooking, but again, soon, sometimes just when you're late or if you're going to hike, you just want something easy. So I'm going to get the tranja together and boil some water up. Time for a curry pot in the dough. Lovely. Time. You've got a lot of pot in the door, don't you? For, for just pure ease. Oh, and it's not just any 
curry pot noodle. It's the king pot noodle. Well enough, I've actually remembered some cutlery. Result. I'll give that a wee mix in a bit. Let it sit for a couple of minutes. And that'll be good to go. Oh, yes, well, I can't wait. Mm. I'm going to that down here. And... Oh, well enough. Be cheeky. Then these. Cheers, folks. All the best. So a wee uh, cheeky Henry Westons and a, a King Curry pot noodle, original curry. I'm just going to sit back and chillax. I'll probably go up, uh, when I go up in the morning as well, I'll be, I'll be cook myself a wee fry up, get some bacon and eggs. Oh yes, bacon, eggs, morning rolls, a bit of brown sauce, good to go. Then, in the morning I'll, I'll hike back to where the car is. Might stop at a couple of bits on my way to when I meet the other boys tomorrow. A couple of bits you've probably seen before, but a couple of bits I just like going to. I've been to quite recently. But, it's just good, oh, I just love it. I know I say a million times, but I just, I just love this. Love it. Love it. Oh, and uh, tomorrow, <coughs> excuse me, I've got, uh, I've got a hot tent for tomorrow night. That'll be good as well. I can't tell I might actually even, I might actually get a tiny wee fire going tonight. Why not? I'm out there. We fire, who that heat? And then I can climb in my bag later on. But right now, I'm just looking forward to this pot noodle. Well bon appetit. Curry pot noodle. Lovely. Hmm. Oh, aye. Something about uh, when you're out, especially on a kind of colder night, there's just something about getting a hot, hot food, aren't you? You see some folks turning up and they've got a, they've got a cheese piece or something. <laughs> I say, oh, I just like something hot to eat. Mm. Anyway, I'll scoff this. Still got chocolate biscuits to go. Chocolate biscuits. Oh. Couple more brews. <laughs> That's all good. Oh, it's just great. You just, you just can't beat it. Cannot beat it. And Compared to visit that, uh, that big YouTube meetup, I had a few of that night. Probably a few too many. But just that was a brilliant weekend, that uh, YouTube meetup, and I think we'll have, to, uh, we'll have more of them. Like I say, I do like a, I like a wee solo, but I do like a group camp. Especially the kind of crowd we go with. They're just all, all decent folk. Oh, I tell you, I could lick that clean. <laughs> I could lick it clean, but my tongue's not long enough. 
Jobs are good, but that didn't last very long. So I'm going to uh, sit and enjoy my cider. I'm just going to have the one tonight. I'm just going to try and get a reasonable early tonight because so I've got a wee hike back. I want to go and kind of see a couple of bits, probably get some more photos, a wee bit more footage tomorrow as well. But still, uh, like I say, still got a uh, route to go. Biscuits. Oh, biscuits tonight. We shout out for Ryan. Ryan. Give me loads of beet butcher meat. Oh, Ryan, top man by the way. Absolutely. Just immense. Those Chinese chops. Very nice. Thick, thick Chinese chops. Oh, they were just all the silly wee things you get at the supermarket. These are proper butcher's things. Oh, they were absolutely lovely. A lamb. Immense. But, like I say, tomorrow, Dutch oven. Or should I say, the next video, I'll see about a Dutch oven cooking, and that'll be the scratch. Oh, just a, a good hearty meal. But, but coming into winter, I think you'll see a lot more uh, Dutch oven cooking as well. That's a plan. It's coming into colder weather. I'm going to try and get a, a good, uh, good Christmas dinner cooked again this year. Get a crowd of full box. Turkey, roast potatoes, Brussels sprouts. I don't like Brussels sprouts, but the rest of them do. Gravy, uh, carrots. It's the full dinner, Christmas dinner this year. That's going to happen as well. Obviously, for a wee bit away for Christmas. But I'm looking forward to that. That'll be good. Uh, what else? Hogmanay as well. That'll be a good one. Right, uh, since it's a cold, I'm gonna. I just need to get a wee fire. Just a wee one. Some folk moan about a fire, but. I think as long as you don't leave a mess and you tidy it up. We'll use an existing fire pit, then. I don't see anything wrong with it. And it is nice in a cold night. Just a nice wee bit of heat. And it is. Fire as well, especially if there's a cow here. It's nice to have. I always think it's like a kind of focal point. Everybody can sit around about it. But some folk moan about it. Hey ho. Oh, it's great. I just love, I love the gallery for it. It's just so quiet. Something about that. That silence. You literally kind of hear a thing. Apart from maybe the odd geese or that. Good for the soul, folks. Good for the soul. Anyway, I'm going to get it. Definitely, I don't know, it must be minus something. We'll definitely get to sub zero. Oh, yeah. Bring on the snow. Right, fire. Let's get a fire on.
Right. Oh, I'll tell you, I love these army sleeping bags. I'll take one to a sleeping bag. There's an absolute ton, but oh, I'll tell you, it's the warmest bag ever. Anyway, you know what time it is? Time for a brew. And not just a brew, time for a brew and some chocolate biscuits. So, what we got tonight? Like I say, we shout out to Ryan. Never ate these uh, last time over it. We'll get some other milka chocolate moo. Don't mind the biscuit. Oh, yes. And as ever, we've got to dunk them, don't we? Very nice. I realised I've had that milk of chocolate before, but it's the first time I've had these. They're not too shabby. So. I'm also, I wouldn't be surprised if I end up eating a food packet of these, to be honest. But not to worry. Tonight, I've got a pack of chocolate digesters for tomorrow night. Brilliant. I'm going to dig into these. Right, brew's done in, chocolate biscuit's done in. The crash out, bring you back in the morning, should give you a fry up, and then we'll hike back. Good night, all. Oh. Oh, man. Oh, great sleep. Right, it's a bit. I don't know, 20 past 8. 20 past 8. It's the middle of nowhere. <laughs> I've got a rough, I've got a rough idea where I am. But what we'll do, we'll get up and we'll get a look outside and see actually, actually where we are. All part of the adventure. But I'm not sure, I know, like I said, I know roughly what what kind of direction I walked in. But that's what I love of it, just getting out and just going exploring. So let's go up and uh, we'll look outside and I'll show you where I am. Now that it's light, obviously, but here that it's dark, you can't see much. Even though I don't want to get up because oh, I see these that way when you're in your sleeping bag. It's just, oh, there's just something about it. And that's. This sleeping bag in particular, oh, it's just, it's just so warm. But I'm gonna have to get up. So I'm gonna get up, get outside. Let's see where, let's have a, let's basically work it. Where are we? It's obviously been raining. Right, let's get outside. So Galloway Forest. So that's where we are. It's 
still cold, but it's, it's not as cold as when it was uh, yesterday morning. So I'm going to get up. Uh, I'm going to do it. I'll probably get my sleeping bag. Got my kind of sleeping arrangements away. Get my bag kind of more or less packed. And then it's time for bacon and eggs. A couple of bacon and egg rolls. A wee brew. Get the, the pack on the back. And we'll start hiking back towards the car. Uh, but must be, I'm quite hungry, so as ever, I'm always hungry, aren't I? Bacon and egg roll time. Well, once I get that stuff, all my stuff, my pack. Stay with us. Right, we change our plan. Uh, I decided I'm just going to, I've pulled the tent down. Seeing it's dry, I'm going to start hiking back towards the car. And maybe about halfway back, we'll get the bait rolls and eggs. Actually, for a second there, I thought I'd forgotten the eggs, but I found them. So I've got the eggs, I've got the bacon, I've got the rolls. We're good to go. But I'm going to, I've kind of packed up, got my, Everything in my pack. I've got the everything's cleared. Leave no trace. So we'll start hiking back, and we'll get some bacon and eggs and a wee brew. I just thought while it's dry, I don't know whether it's going to rain again today. I just thought while it's dry, I'll just get the tent down. I'll start hiking back, but I'll maybe stop about halfway. Uh, I know roughly where I am. So I'm sure there's a nice week in a rubber spot in the direction I'm heading back. So I'll maybe stop there, get the bacon rolls on. So stay with me. Let's go. <laughs> Hey, oh. hey, walk no further, walk no further, then we get bacon and egg rolls. So, let's get kicking. Look at you. Look 
looks good to me. Breakfast. Bacon and egg rolls with a bit of brown sauce. Bon appetit. Tell you, ready for us. I'm actually starving now, sir. So. Oh, that's just superb. Mm. Right, I'm going to score for this, get a brew, bring it back in a minute. You know what time it is. It's brew time. Oh, cheers.